This is From Nothing to Gloves with Profitable Trade-Ups. The series where I started with zero dollars and will be using nothing but profitable trade-ups to get myself a pair of gloves. If you missed any of the previous episodes, make sure to check those out. But to quickly recap, our goal is set at $1,500 to get ourselves a pair of factory new Imperial plaid gloves to go with the rest of my purple loadout. We ended the last episode with $327.48 in our balance. By the way, I'm giving away this Stat Track factory new Ursus Knife Tiger Tooth when we hit 50,000 subscribers. If you'd like to enter for a chance to win, check out the community post. I'll leave a link to that in the description below. Now, let's get these gloves. Needless to say, last episode did not go to plan. Luckily, we did end the video off with some good hits, but before that, we quite literally missed four 50-50 Desert Eagle print stream trade-ups in a row. The odds of that are so small that it's scary. But if you guys know me, you know that I do not accept taking L's. So today, we're starting this episode off with five more 50-50 Desert Eagle print stream trade-ups. If we don't see at least three, I'm going to Gavin's house for a meeting. People are always asking me what the best marketplace is to buy and sell their skins on. Look no further because the answer is today's sponsor, GamerPay. GamerPay is the best peer-to-peer -peer skin trading website out there, and to prove it to you, they're even offering you a free 5 euros on your first 50 euro transaction. One cool feature they have is, on top of showing the GamerPay listing price, they also display the cheapest buff listing price for the item you're looking at so you can see how much of a discount you're actually getting. They also have a 0% buying fee and only a small 3% selling fee. So if you're looking for better prices than buff, and 5 euros for free, sign up with my link in the description today. Today's first trade up consists of 1 Stat Trek Minimal Wear and 9 Stat Trek Field Tested Classified Skins from the Fracture Case below a 0.1875 average float. The easiest way to do this is by getting the Stat Trek Minimal Wear skin below a 0.09 float and the 9 Stat Trek Field Tested Skins below a 0.198 float. Make sure to get the Stat Trek Minimal Wear skin for $8.83 or less and the Stat Trek Field Tested Skins for $5.18 or less. This trade up costs around $55.45 total and has a 100 15.08% profitability after steam fees, with a 50% chance to profit each time. Obviously, the chase item here is the Stat Trek Minimal Wear Desert Eagle print stream for over $44 of profit. Alright boys, the plan is to do 5 of these bad boys today. We had absolutely atrocious luck with these in the past, but today that changes. Show me a Desert Eagle print stream on the first click. Come on, Gaben, bless us. 3, 2, 1, BOOM! Dude? Really? That's five AK Anubises in a row on this trade up. Like, what even is that? No, 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 no. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're about to hit. We're about to hit. I know it. Copium, copium, copium. All right. Second one. I just want to see the Desert Eagle. Please show us the Deagle. Three, two, one, boom. Dude, six in a row and counting. Third trade up. You know what? I think the problem is I've been getting hype before each of them. Maybe Gaben just wants a calm day. Gaben, let us please see the Deagle. Three, two, one, boom. All right, this is actually getting ridiculous. I don't know if I agree with these odds. I don't think it's 50-50, dude. These literally can't be 50-50. Bro, like what? All right, well, it's already impossible to get three Deagles, so I'm going to Gaben's house and I am going to off him. Kidding, kidding, in game. But please, just please let us see Deagles on these last two, please. Three, two, one, boom. Dude, okay, no, it's actually not 50-50. It's actually not 50-50. That can't be possible. That can't be possible. This is like below a 0.01% chance to hit eight of these 50-50s in a row. Like, what the actual frick, dude? All right, well, it's our last chance. I mean... I don't even know what to think anymore. I, uh, we're probably going to miss it. Who cares? Nice. Awesome. Great. Yep. Let's move on to the next one. Great contract. Great contract. Never try this one. Ever. Do not ever try this. I'm giving away this minimal wear Nova Moon in Libra. To enter, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and leave any comment. The second trade up consists of three factory new classified skins from the glove case and seven minimal wear classified skins from the kilowatt case below a 0.07 average float. The easiest way to do this is by getting the glove skins below a 0.029 float and the kilowatt skins below a 0.0875 float. Make sure to get the glove skins for $7.70 or less and the kilowatt skins for $12.30 or less. This trade up costs around $110 total and has a 110.29% profitability after steam fees with a 70% chance to profit each time. Both skins from the kilowatt the Watt case are profitable with the AK-47 Inheritance easily being the best at over $75 of profit. All right, 
This second contract better save us, dude. We have a 70% chance, I think, to profit here. I would have told you I had a 50% chance to profit on that last one, but that's clearly not true. Like, I'm like 99% sure that some of these trade-ups, like the math is off somewhere because the Temu Cow trade-up, the 50-50 Temu Cow trade-up, I think I've done probably 20 of them at least in my lifetime. And I think I've only hit two Temu Cows ever. And I've done a bunch of those Desert Eagle ones. And I think I've only hit maybe one ever. Like the math's gotta be off somewhere. Realistically, there's not actually any data directly from Valve that gives us information on the percentages. So it's all speculation. Um, But yeah, either way, I'm hoping to see an AK inheritance here. Like we need to see an AK inheritance here. I actually don't think it's possible for us to make money on this episode unless we hit three profit outcomes in, the row, in a row and two of them have to be the AK inheritance. I actually don't think it's possible for us to make a profit here unless we see three profit outcomes in a row and two of them have to be the AK inheritance. So not likely at all, but what's it gonna be? Three, two, one AK. Okay, that's fine. I got baited. I honestly thought that was a loss outcome as I, I was about to freak out. I was literally about to freak out, but that's still good. $30 of profit right there. I mean, we're still hella in the red today, but it, it's a good start, I guess. It's a good start. It makes up for one of the AK Legion of Anubises. One of them. We need to see an AK Inheritance on this next one. All right, trade up number two. Please show us an AK Inheritance, please. Three, two, one, boom. Like, I... I, I, I actually just don't have anything to say, really. Um, this is the worst day of trade-ups I've ever had in my life. Uh, sorry for the lack of energy. I'm just getting annoyed. Feels like we made a bunch of progress for nothing and we're getting set back. But I guess that's what happens sometimes with trade-ups. It is what it is. Eighth and final trade-up of the video, the third and final for the kilowatts. What's it gonna be? We're so far in the negative, it's absolutely absurd. But this is our last chance to make any of it back. Show me the inheritance, please. Three, two, one, boom. Okay, that's fine. It's still profit. I, I honestly thought it was gonna be another loss outcome. I wouldn't have been surprised at all. I think we're sitting around like 170 in the balance and we started at like 330, so we pretty much cut our balance in half today. Great episode, great, wonderful, splendid, fantabulous episode. I'm losing my mind. Uh, yeah, I guess let me go to the calculations. All right, boys, after all was said and done, these are the eight skins that we came out with, and we ended with a balance of $167.93, pretty much half of what we had at the beginning. So not a good day at all, to say the least. I guess the one redeeming quality would be that this piece of S looks decent. Just kidding, it looks horrible. It's a terrible skin. What am I on about? These are all terrible, bad, bad, all right, all right, sorry, sorry. I'm waffling, I'm in a bad mood. It is what it is. You go into trade-ups expecting to profit, but that's not always what's gonna happen. But as I always say when I take the losses, the one redeeming quality seriously this time is that at least it's proof that I show you the L's too. It's never always gonna be sunshine and rainbows. You're not always gonna be making money. There is always a chance to lose. And you can clearly see that because today we took a fat L. But if you feel bad for me at all, please, please, please check out the links in the description. Join the Discord. We're always chilling in there. We have so many members now. I think we're about to hit 4,000, which is sick. We also do weekly giveaways in there separate from the video weekly giveaways, which is super cool. Check that out. There's also a link in the description to the 50,000 subscriber giveaway. Check that out too. And yeah, man, thank you for watching. Sorry we didn't profit today. We're gonna have to go back to the drawing board and figure out what the plan is from here. I'll catch you guys in episode 12. If you enjoyed this video, YouTube thinks you'll like this one too. Oh yeah, and YouTube told me 75% of you aren't subscribed yet. So go thumb wrestle that subscribe button down below.